All right, what's going on, everyone on YouTube? And yes, Ruler, welcome to day number 15 of my 31 Days of Horror. This week we're doing Halloween, so we're gonna be talking about Halloween three seasons of the seasons of the witch today. Tongue twister. So uh, Halloween three, when when uh, it got released, you know, many people were often quite pissed off about the entry into the series because it didn't include Michael Myers and they kept the Halloween franchise name going anyhow. So many people were pretty ticked off about the movie and that often got the movie a bad rap that it didn't actually deserve because the movie's pr actually pretty badass good. And, um, you know, John Carpenter wrote it and everything, but, you know, people can't get past that there's no Michael Myers and we all know how the rest of the series went, like I said yesterday. So, uh, Season Witch 3 is a movie about a, you know, it's kind of like a big corporation theme, Shadon type theme. But corporation creates these Halloween masks called Lucky... Lucky Charms, maybe? Lucky something. can't remember the name. And, uh, you know, these masks, when children wear them, and watch something on the TV, you know, the, the famous uh, mass, you know, going back and forth on the TV. Uh, these masks start to eat their faces, and uh, at the time, it was pretty pretty fucked up seeing all these, you know, these kids die by getting their faces eaten, and, you know, snakes start coming out of the mass and shit like that. So, of course, Tom Adkins' character uh, tries to stop what the hell is going on with these masks that are killing all these children and it's pretty much what the film is about and it's a pretty great movie to be honest you know like I said many people cannot get past that it's a hollow not a Michael Myers film but that it's its own separate separate uh film into its entry and as time go on more and more people are jumping on board about it actually liking it uh you know it's been popular in the horror community for a while now you know a lot of you know horror fans really like season of the witch but you know in the mainstream you know i think it's starting to catch on a little bit more than what it was back when it got released and more people are seeing it for what it is and are enjoying it for its separate for its separate entry to the series than just Michael Myers because everyone has seen the sequels after Seasons of the Witch and pretty much knew how shitty they were um, but we're going to have to talk about that tomorrow with Halloween 4 my opinion on the, you know, the new trilogy as it's called that gets started with the back with the return of Michael coming back to the series in Halloween 4 but um, if you guys want to give a good you know, cheesy horror flick, a chance, give Season of the Witch a watch if you haven't watched it, it's really good. Just think of it as not Halloween, something else, and you definitely would enjoy it. So, I hope everybody has enjoyed my day 15th review, we're halfway through just about, tomorrow will be the halfway mark, so um, keep going strong, and I shall talk to you guys tomorrow with the return of Michael Myers. So I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Uh, if you want to follow me on Twitter, you can do so. Twitter.com slash NESRuler22. Make sure you thumbs up this video and leave a comment down below. I shall talk to you guys tomorrow with Halloween 4. So I'll see you guys tomorrow.